People are talking. Many have questions. Is this just about being uncomfortable with sex ed books? Is this about censorship? CBC has reported that the library board has decided to keep the books. Is that true? There are always two sides to the story. If you weren't one of the 150 people who came to listen to what the delegation had to say to the board, you might be missing some important facts. Fact. The delegation presented four world issues to the South Central Regional Library Board. Pornography, child abuse, grooming and accountability. Fact. I have been approached by the local and provincial media outlets. I have responded to every request, either by doing an interview or sending a statement. Some media stations have chosen to say that no statement was given. Others have chosen to edit the statement to not include quoting the criminal code. Fact. The foundation of the presentation was the Criminal Code of Canada. Section 151, 152 and 163 define child pornography, define written pornography, outline the age of consent and state the consequences of distributing pornographic materials. Google the Criminal Code and see what it says for yourself. We are not inventing the boundaries. The law is the law. Fact. Under the topic of grooming, one of the books discussed was the novel All Boys Aren't Blue, temporarily pulled from the online selection of the South Central Regional Library. Allow me to read the section of this book that was presented to the board. The, nar the narrator is a 10-year-old boy. Page 206. You were much taller than me, probably by a, about a good foot. You told me to take off my pajama pants, which I did. You then took off your shorts, followed by your boxers. You stood there, fully erect, and said, taste it. At first I laughed and refused, but then you said, come on, Matt, taste it. This is what boys like us do when we, when we like each other. I finally listened to you. The whole time I knew it was wrong, not because I was having sexual intercourse with a guy, but that you were my family. Fact. Contrary to CBC's recent report, the board has not yet responded to the delegation's request, which is that any children or youth materials that contain pornography, that invite children to sexual touching, or that could, or that could be used for grooming purposes, are removed from all South Central Regional Libraries.